Hey guys, it is X Deadman 18 x here back with another amazing video. Today's video is going to be really focused on missiles. And I know you probably read in the title that this video is going to have a lot, and by a lot I mean a lot, to do with cool missiles and blowing stuff up. Let's jump right into it. So this video is primarily about how to build a missile. And it may seem simple at first, and it really is. All you got to do to activate it is take your foot and steel. This one was gifted to my god himself, and you just and it just goes. It moves at exactly 3.3 blocks per second. When it hits the target, the TNT on the far left activates and it causes it to blow up. No, that's a lot of damage. I attempted to blow up that house, but. The cobblestone really, really, really got in the way. And as you can see, there's basically a lot of cobblestone. A lot of cobblestone. So, what I decided to do with my uh, grand amount of cobblestone is just move the missile up a little bit. Just... So, let's jump right into it. I'm just going to elevate this, this real quick. Really simple. It takes a 2x7 area to build. You want to have it facing the direction you want to go, so have the 7 length and the 2 width facing the direction you want to go. I want it to go there. So the first thing you're going to want to do is take your piston and set it like that. You do not want it touching the floor or anything for that case around it, which is why I'm setting it up like this, once block above the ground, facing the direction I want it to go. You want this first piston to be facing the direction you want it to go. Next things, next, you put this thing right on that piston facing the other direction no sticky pistons yet i know i have one we'll use it later you want to take your slime blocks and do a two by two configuration like this and put a tnt block directly on the end this slime block right here will not be needed so you just break that bad boy right there and you can come through you should have a safe that, that looks similar to this if not exactly this you know it should be exactly this next you want to do is take your other piston slap that bad boy right here put a slime block on the end of it this is where the sticky piston comes in you put it right there nothing special right there you then take your obsidian block slap it right here on the end take your block of redstone activate it make sure that it pushes forward but nothing like crazy happens take your slime block put it right here on this TNT with a block of redstone on top. We're basically done with the mechanics. All we need to do now is add a slime block, an observer, and another slime block. That's that's basically it. The only thing that comes next is the TNT. You wanna go one, two, three, four. Four long on this side, two long on the top, and then you wanna do those two right here. Before you break this, you then break it, and place it down. This is the longest your missile can be anymore, and it will not move. It is the push limit for the pistons. It's 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 good. It's it's fine. It really still is gonna have a massive impact on that poor 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 little house. So this is where the fun begins. You activate and watch it go. Please. Thank you all for watching. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video. This one did not take much work, <laughs> but it was really fun to make. And I hope it helped some of you out there troll your friends and like blow up their bases or whatever, make some missiles. These things go on forever. They don't just stop. So like, it's a pretty solid weapon for ranged. I don't know why you would not use this. It does take a lot of resources. Which is like why I can see the people not using it, but it's really fun to make, really quick to make. You can build in like 10 seconds if you go fast enough once you kind of memorize it, which I have because I'm a master Minecrafter. Once you have it all down, you can build an epic missile like this and just blow stuff up. It's honestly a lot of fun, and I probably will be doing some videos on like making it better and stuff in the future. But I really did hope you all enjoyed. Make sure to like the video, subscribe, and comment down below for any, any more tutorial ideas or video ideas that you want in the future because any ideas and support really does help out the channel a lot. I'll see you all in the next video. Next day, 18x here, signing off.